Well, I'm here with Megan Jones and the very lovely Candy, Candy, who has come over from South Australia to compete at the Camperdown Horse Trials at Lakes and Craters. Hello, Candy. You're very gorgeous and very, very friendly. <laughs> and Candy is um, part of a new syndicate idea that Megan is um, working on. So tell us about what's happening, Megan, with some of your lovely horses yes. and what you're going to do. Well, we're trying to find owners for them to form a syndicate for each each horse and this way I can keep all my nice horses and I have to actually sell them off to pay for the the rest of them. So looking for people who want to support the sport, support support us and be involved with some really nice young up and coming horses. Um, we've got a, a few of them, we've got a number of two year olds, three year olds and this girl is, is five, that holds but Behind us is five, we have a one star mare, one of the, the young ones has already been sold, he's, he's got good owners and uh, yes, yeah, so we're just um, looking for people who want to be involved in the sport as, 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 as um, owners and to be a part of our team basically. And what, mm. what do they actually get? What happens? What happens? They buy a share of the horse, so each horse has five syndicates per per horse which makes up a half share in the horse and per syndicate people can get three or four friends together to form that one particular syndicate or camera she says <laughs> and then they get updates on the the horses they get owners t-shirts and jackets and 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 there are and um a part of our t -t 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 team come to dinners with us the p tents and really be in involved in the sport and um, have the honour of, of having a horse yeah. in our great sport. But they get updates, photos, videos and they're not sort of saying well now pay me for your share and then we're not going to speak to you. We'll have the, yeah. the owners really involved and James does his job. Yeah. Get them involved and come to the parties and, and have a, a really good time yeah. at the well, events. I mean, I've been lucky enough to be an owner with some horses and I just know that the, the actual involvement of, yeah. with the horse and the, and the training and everything yeah. is just fantastic. What, what, them grow? Going to yes. here? <laughs> what do they say about not working with children? Now, exactly. Um, and so tell us a little bit about uh, Candy. What's, what's her doing, doing here? Yeah, well, she's yeah. doing her first ever event. I probably really shouldn't have brought her along really because there's a premium for her first event. Yeah. She was broken in in January and then had a bit of light work turned out while I was away and has been in work since I've been back. But she's so crazy and has learnt really quickly. And the prelim cut class here is normally a really nice cross country course and a few logs and a little water jump and it's all pretty nice but this year it's kind of on steroids. <laughs> I'm more the train going, oh pop candy, there's a bit more, a bit more mature now. I'm sure she'll be fine but um, it's definitely a bit tougher but she's just here to have an outing and we're coming here so why not chuck them on the truck and just start them to get out and, and doing things. She yes. did her first test today, I haven't got any scores yet because the scores are really a bit slow today because the scores aren't here but she did a great test and she relaxed, she went to her corners and she was soft and, and um, swinging so I was wrapped with the chest yeah. today. Yeah she's a really good girl. And they are of course homebred horses too. Yeah, home Tell bread. us a little bit about the breeding. Well she's out of a thoroughbred mare who's a Muston Lake mare which went oh, probably advanced present George dressage before mm -hmm. being retired to stud. So a really big rangy thoroughbred mare that just moved beautifully. And once she got retired from dressage we bought her and, and took it to, to um, stud and her sire is our Kirby Park Nantambu, who's our thoroughbred stock horse today. So he's a little bit of stock horse in there, so he is a stock horse, he's got papers, but he's basically a thoroughbred, and so he's the sire of Joy and Empress and a whole pile of horses which have gone, gone places and all yeah. jump really well, move really well, and are really trainable. Yeah. And you obviously think these horses are going places, otherwise mm. you wouldn't be riding them. Absolutely. So no. You're aiming for the top with them. Absolutely. Got Church, Candy, Freckles, Memphis, those four are super, super special. If anybody wants to get involved in Floyd, we'll, we can we can talk, talk about, about that. that as well. <laughs> yes, yes. His owners have actually given him to us now as 100% oh, ownership in, in him now. So they gave it to James and I, so we are... Is that a wedding only, present? It was a wedding present, <laughs> yes, it was a wedding present for us. So we now have him, so we're sort of keen to find people to help us 
keep him on the, the road mm. as well, and he'll be a, uh, a very <laughs> exciting one. I think one. come home with me. She I was think I should join the syndicate. I think you should. I think you should. She's beautiful. <laughs> and, um, and then I have the stallions and I have yes. Empress's full sister who's turning four, who, she, who just started, who's impressive as well, really impressive. So we've got lots of coming from the two-year-olds, so they can even get involved at a very young stage at a much cheaper Right, yep. obviously, and 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 start at the start, start, and then watch their horse come from a three-year-old to four-year-old, and move up the grades like that. They can buy into horses that they want to say, okay, we want to have a horse that's going to go to the games. Which ones aren't you going to sell? Mm -hmm. I said, well, these four, I'm really keen to keep. Whereas that one over there, I will sell. So somebody might, go, okay, I'll get jump on board with that horse. I want it to be a bit of a fun investment for yep. me, and get my. my money back at the, the end of it and, and sell the, yeah. the horse. Um, so there's, there's lots of options there as yeah. to what people can, can so do. You'll sit down with people and sort of work out yeah. what it is that they want to achieve from it. Exactly. Is it fun, is it for investment? And then yes. find the horse that that is right Exactly. Then. We've got lots there to choose from. Yeah. Well, beautiful. I would say, I would say to anyone who wants to have some fun in eventing, and get yes. <laughs> head knocked around, um, to have a chat with Megan and James and find out more about the syndicate. Because mm. I think it's a great way keeping Australian horses here in Australia yeah, that are going to go to the games and to the World Equestrian Games for Australia and it's going to be a lot of fun for people too. So thanks a lot. Thank you. Final day, so they could be on a penalty score of 101.4.